It was very um, shifty and flicky, the whole course today, and so, you know, a lot of people were, you know, lucky to be picking up big lifts and, and there were big knocks and, you know, the, the, the wind was changing around 20 or 30 degrees, it was quite extraordinary, so we had a good time, yeah, yeah it was great. Oh, it was pretty tricky out there. Uh, Bruce was all over the place, coming and going, but uh, our tactician picked it up pretty well and we had a reasonably good day. We won the first race and uh, we just seemed to go the right way and uh, things worked out for us. Had a second in the second race and then we won the third race and in the fourth race we, we had a fourth. It's a pretty good day all told. Yeah, we started off pretty well. Uh, we had a fifth, uh, I think a fourth, and then we finished up the day with two seconds. So we're pretty happy with that. Uh, Nathan uh, pulled us out a bit of bit of trouble and got us up. Just got to sail as best we can, try and limit the mistakes and try and uh, you know, keep up with the other guys and see where we are at the end of the day and just try and push as hard as we can and work as a team. And at the end of the day, this is really just to try and uh, get a bit more experience as a group and try and build our, build our team up and uh, hopefully do better towards the end of the season. going to make it extremely competitive. Transfusion of course are always there. Uh, Kokomo, Estate Master, I mean all those boats can show that they can win on any day so it's going to be very competitive and it's great to see uh, the other boats getting in there. Uh, you know last year Transfusion they really dominated throughout the entire series and uh, this year we're obviously seeing a much tighter competition and that's great for everyone.
uh, there was a different weather pattern today. It was really quite light towards the end and tricky. Um, again, our tactician got us through most of that, David Chapman. Terrific effort today. And Skip Baxter, our main sheet hand, kept me on the pace, so uh, all the crew did a great job. Not much different to yesterday, but uh, finishing up with two wins was absolutely terrific. One mistake and you go from first to last very easily. It was better uh, for us, uh, we got a second and uh, we're leading in one race which was abandoned so that was disappointing so I think our crew work was a lot better and, uh, and we liked the, you know, the, the ver variability of the wins, that was good. Uh, obviously to get the podium finish is still good in this fleet, you know, it's a very difficult, very competitive fleet. We did a little bit better today than we did yesterday so I guess that, that bit is good, uh, we, at least we improved. but. Um, we, uh, you know, the, the, result, the results are simple, you know, if you put a lot of work in, you get a lot of results out. Uh, and we have, just haven't put enough work in and the others have that beat us, so I guess that's the plan for next time around. Then the other area we are trying to work on a lot was on our top mark turns and our downwind sailing, which helped us keep, a, I suppose, controlling positions and be able to play the game. Not that we always won the game, but at least we were in, in with the fight. Well, there's the uh, state championships coming up in uh, in January, so with Aberdeen's uh, sponsorship, is, which is great, you know, um, we'll just have to improve on our teamwork and try and get better, and uh, then do the 10th, what is it, 10th, 9th, 10th, 11th and 12th, and then, uh, you know, depending on how that all goes and how finances work out, whether we end up taking the boat down to uh, Hobart to do the Nationals down in Tasmania. I think, I think Middle Harbour, they did a good job of everything, except that race today was a bit tough, the one we were leading, but no, I thought it was all good, the racing was really tight, and yeah, and congratulations to Voodoo Chow, they started really, very well and consistent the whole way, it was good. Sydney Harbour, what a best place to sail. <laughs> Look forward to the next one.